I think an ongoing challenge is the topic that I've been working on uh, already since the 90s, and that is nonlinear effects, tipping points. For example, the Atlantic overturning circulation, commonly known as the Gulf Stream system. We still don't really have a good handle on uh, how close to a threshold we are there. We know there is one, but we don't know how close we are because these nonlinear phenomena they are very sensitively dependent on the exact state of the system and so models thus far still widely disagree on how stable or unstable the Gulf Stream system will be under global warming in the future. And, but that also applies in some other areas uh, like how, does the, how do the big continental ice sheets respond to global warming is also quite a non-linear phenomenon and in the past has been really underestimated by uh, climate models. And there is another effect that is the changes in the atmospheric circulation, including uh, the jet stream. That's uh, one area of research where we are working on currently and which has a really a big impact on extreme weather events. And I think it's, it's this kind of phenomena that we need to understand much better.